a lot of mysteries with the coronavirus are yet to be solved. Not only what treatment really works, but why some people are getting sicker than others, even healthy people. Why? Well, that's a good question. In the hospitals, there are the sick and the sicker. Could this explain why some people get sicker than others? I asked Dr. Daniel Pastula, a neuroinfectious disease specialist at UC Health. It's, I think it's a combination. The people who are very ill we know are often older or have risk factors, but that is in everything. Dr. Pastula notes there are two parts of the immune system, the innate and the adaptive and they go to war with viruses. Imagine your base or city is getting attacked. The innate immune system is kind of a nonspecific warning system that essentially says, hey, we're getting attacked, all defenses up. That's what makes you feel sick, the fever and fatigue. The adaptive immune system is basically a highly um, specialized group of fighters that are trained to attack and kill a specific virus. But it needs time to arrive at the battle. Researchers are trying to uncover what they call the minimally infectious dose. It's a number. Get fewer and your body beats it back. Get more, get infected. The higher the viral dose you initially get, we do think there's probably a correlation with whether you develop symptoms or not and how severe those symptoms are. But protect yourself with social distancing and cleaning and you're likely better off. And that's what we have control over and that's what we can do. And that is your good question. With social distancing, we do have a chance to keep that viral dose down. The lower the amount of the viral material you get, the better your chances may be.